I can't let them win the golden gift! Aha! This ought to make sure they don't get there before me! <laughs> Crusher blocked the tunnel through these mountains. Hey, but look over there. It's another tunnel. But to follow it, we'll need some way to ride on those old train tracks. Hey, I know what we could use to ride on those tracks. A steam engine. Yeah. A steam engine boils water to make steam. And that steam pushes a piston to make the train's wheels turn. Come on! To turn Blaze into a steam engine, first, drag over the special driving wheels to keep Blaze steady on the track. Driving wheels! Nice! Next, drag over the boiling tank. It holds all the boiling hot water. Boiler! Last, drag over the chimney. The chimney pumps out smoke and steam. Chimney! Oh, yeah! I'm a steam engine monster machine! All right! Yeah! Full steam ahead! Full of big shiny gemstones. Hubcaps, we've got to get through this cave without getting hit by falling gems. I know. We can keep away from the gems if we predict where they're gonna fall. Yeah! When you predict, you use what you know to make your best guess about what's gonna happen next. Look, more gemstones up ahead! And we know the gems always lean in the direction they're about to fall. Which track do you think they're going to fall on? The yellow track or the blue track? The blue track, yeah! Quick, take the yellow track instead! Our prediction was right! Yeah! <gasps> Watch out, please! Oh! We have to get past one last pile of gemstones. Let's predict. Which track do you think they're going to fall on? The yellow track, yes! Almost mine, and I bet it's gonna be something so oh, good. <laughs> Daring time! Daring time! Oh, I can't let him win the race. Looks like I'll need one last cheat. Something no one will ever get past. Me. Gargantuan guards! <laughs> oh man! If we're gonna get to that golden gift, we gotta find some way past those gargantuan guards! Hey, wait! I've got an idea! What if we find something big and heavy that rolls? Yeah! Then we can roll it at those guards and knock them out of the way! Ooh! Say fine big round bowling ball! Say! Good one, Zeg! I wonder if that'll roll. Let's predict. When we push this bowling ball, do you think it'll roll? Okay, let's see. It's rolling! Yay! <laughs> Gargantuan guard! <laughs> but there's still two 
two more blocking the way! Hey! Maybe we can roll this big wooden block at him! Hmm, what do you think? When we push the block, do you think it's gonna roll? Let's find out! Nope, the block doesn't roll. Better look for something else. Uh, hey! What about this giant rock I found? Good idea, Darrington. If we push this rock, do you think it'll roll? All right, let's try it. Now there's only one gargantuan guard left! Hey, yo! I wonder if we can roll this at him! Whoa! That big watermelon! Let's predict! When we push the watermelon, do you think it's gonna roll? Let's find out! It's rolling! So long, gargantuan guards! Hey, everyone, look! There it is! The golden gift! But Crusher's almost there! Golden gift? <laughs> Gonna be... <laughs> Uh-oh, that bad! We can't let Crusher get there first! Then it's time to use blazing speed! <laughs> to give us blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! <laughs> no one can possibly beat me to the golden gift now! Ah, we won the race! Hoppin' hubcaps! Look, y'all! Something's happening to the golden gift! <gasps> gift opening! Now we can finally see what's inside! A simple machine. Yeah, simple machines make it easier to do work. Check it out. Here are all the different types of simple machines. To get to the monkeys, we can use this one, a pulley. Pulleys make lifting things easier. We just have to put heavy things on the other side of the pulley so that it goes down and Blaze goes up. Hey, look, here's a pulley. And we can use these coconuts to make the other side heavier. Come on, 
Let's add enough coconuts to make the other side weigh 12. Is this the number 12? No? All right, let's add more coconuts. We've got to make the other side even heavier. Is that the number 12? Yeah, that's 12, all right. Now that side of the pulley's going down. And we're going up! Yeah! Pizza delivery! <laughs> Here you go! One large banana pizza! <laughs> I think they like it! Check it out! We delivered pizza to the monkeys in the jungle! So next we've got to race to the snow and bring pizza to the penguins! So long, monkeys! <laughs> Super snowmakers covering all the igloos with snow. Oh man, if we're going to bring pizza to those penguins, we've got to find some way to get through all the snow. Hey, I've got an idea. What if we built something to help us dig a tunnel through the snow? We'll make an auger. Yeah! Augers use a type of simple machine called a screw. When the screw turns, it moves stuff out of the way to make a tunnel. Come on, let's get building and turn me into an auger. First, drag over the motor. It's what makes the screw blade spin. Motor! Next, drag over the spring. It keeps the auger steady as we dig. Last, drag over the screw blade so we can dig the tunnel. Screw blade! Oh, yeah! I'm an auger monster machine! To get to their igloo, we could go up, down, left, or right. Click on the direction Blaze should travel in to get to the penguins. Up! Yeah! Here you go, penguins! A fresh, delicious ice pop pizza! <laughs> I think ice pop pizza's their favorite. Check it out! Now we brought pizzas to the monkeys and the penguins. To win the great pizza race, we just have to deliver one last pizza. See you later, penguins. We've got a race to win. Blaze, so fast. I need something to stop him. Something like, like this. <laughs> Blaze, look out! Oh no! There goes our pizza! Baskets! It landed on top of that mountain! <laughs> See you at the finish line! <laughs> Come on! We've got to hurry and get that pizza back! I wonder what that rumbling sound is. Uh-oh, I think this mountain's erupting. Yeah, erupting giant balls of cheese. Oh! oh man, how are we gonna get our pizza back without getting flattened by a giant cheese ball? I know what we need. Something that can break those giant cheese balls apart. We need a wedge. Yeah! 
A wedge is a simple machine that makes it easier to split things apart. Come on, AJ. It's wedge time! Help us smash apart the cheese balls heading our way. When you see a cheese ball, let's click on it. Cheese ball! It worked! Yeah. If you see any more cheese balls, say cheese ball. Cheese ball! Uh-oh, the crusher's almost there. We've only got one chance to deliver our last pizza before Crusher. It's time to use blazing speed. <laughs> to give me blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! <laughs> I knew it! Nobody's gonna deliver their pizza before me! <laughs> Not even... with extra peanuts! <laughs> How are we gonna decide who gets it? Why don't we have a contest to see who gets the marshmallow? A contest? A storytelling contest! Ooh. That sounds fun! Whose story should we listen to first? Let's hear Crusher's story. Check this out! To prepare for his story, let's give him a monster makeover. We'll start with a new paint job. Let's try purple. What about yellow? Maybe green? That looks awesome! Great work! Let's change Blaze's pattern next. Let's try this one. Or maybe this one. Or even this one. What a cool pattern. Nice job. Once upon a time, there was an amazing treasure chest. <laughs> Hang on, Crusher. Is anyone else hearing that strange clicking sound? <laughs> it's those pinching crabs! <laughs> Everyone head for that door! The door closed! Maybe this can open the door. It's a greater than symbol. So, to open the door, let's figure out which there's more of. Red crabs or yellow crabs? <laughs> Are there more red crabs or yellow crabs? Tap on the right answer. You're right! The number of red crabs is greater than the number of yellow crabs. It worked! This way, treasure hunters! <laughs> hey, I guess nothing can stop Chickens? Chickens? <laughs> Quick! Let's use the greater than symbol to open the door. Are there more blue chickens or red chickens? Tap on the correct answer. You got it! The number of blue chickens is greater than the number of red chickens. Just in time! <laughs> this way, everyone! Go, go! <laughs> Phew. 
Okay, here goes. The treasure is ice cream! Wow! There was so much ice cream, the treasure hunters all got to have their favorite flavors. There was even enough for some new friends. <laughs> it was the most delicious treasure hunt ever. The end. Who should be next to tell their story? All right, let's hear Blaze's story. Oh, yeah! To get ready for his tale, let's give Blaze a monster makeover. First things first, a new paint job. How about yellow and green? Or maybe green and turquoise? Let's try blue and purple. That looks fantastic. Way to go. Let's do a pattern next. How about this one? Maybe this one. We'll try this one. That's an amazing pattern. Nice going. Once upon a time, there was a secret school where monster machines learned magic. It was a school for wizards. But there was one wizard who didn't like other monster machines doing magic. Wandium, take away! Oh. <laughs> I'll take away your wands! <laughs> and your wands! Oh, my wand! And your wands! Please, look out! <laughs> Hubcaps! It's Lord Carburetor! He took our wands! Come on, AJ. We've got to hurry and get those wands back. <laughs> I'll have to stop him with this. A lion spell with a magic of three. <laughs> Lord Carburetor made a magic lion. <laughs> to defeat it, we'll need a lion spell of our own. A lion with magic that's more than which number is greater than three? One or five? Tap on the correct answer. You got it! Five is greater than three. Lionisio five! Woohoo! It worked! Let's see Wizard Blaze get past a growling bear with a magic of six. We need to make a bear with magic that's greater than six. Which number is greater than six? Seven or four? Tap on the correct answer. Way to go! Seven is greater than six. Mario Seven! Oh, right. Wizard Blaze is more Powerful than I thought, but not powerful enough to get past a dragon spell with a magic of eight. Gaskets, that's a big dragon. To stop it, we need a magic that's greater than eight. Which number is greater than eight? Four or 10? Tap on the correct answer. That's right. Ten is greater than eight. Dragonium ten. <laughs> the magic wand. We've got to hurry before they fall into the volcano. Help me do a super fast flying spell. Get ready to tap on the blazing speed button. With 
the wands return, the wizards use them to make a wizard party! The end. <laughs> that was great, Blaze! So, Pickle, what do you think? It's a tie! But we can't all have the last marshmallow! Huh, that's true! So it's a good thing I have another bag right here! For the rest of the night, the friends happily roasted marshmallows! <laughs> Help me transform into a police car! First, track over the flashing lights and siren. They help everyone know a police car is coming. Next, track over the searchlight. It helps us look for things that are hard to find. Great! Now, Drag over the official police badge. Outstanding! Oh, yeah! I'm a police car monster machine! Whoa! Looking good, Blaze. Now let's get out there and start helping people. Yeah! It's time to be police officers. Look! Officer Blaze! Officer AJ! Hey, kids. What's the problem? I'm trying to visit my grandma. Me too. So am I. But we can't figure out where our grandmas live. We're lost. Can you help us? Aw, of course we'll help you. That's what police officers do. But how are you going to find where our grandmas live? There's only one way to figure this out. We'll use deduction. Yeah. Deduction is using the facts you know to get closer and closer to an answer. Are you ready to find your grandma now? Uh-huh. I know my grandma lives somewhere with a green door, orange flowers, and one window. Whoa, good remembering. Come on, let's use those facts to find grandma's building. Which of these buildings has a green door, orange flowers, and one window? That one! Right! Oh, Grandma! I'm here! Oh, and you're just in time, too! I made fresh lemonade! Mmm! Delicious! And how about some lemonade for you, officers? Sure! Thank you, ma'am! Mmm! Mm. Now you two keep up the good work! We will! Hop in, Officer AJ! We've got to get moving! There's still more police work to do. Police officers, let's, let's ride. And police officers. Yeah. Look, there's our friend Debris, the garbage truck. My puppy Pierre. Where are you? He sounds like he really needs our help. What's the matter, Debris? Ah, Officer Blaze, Officer AJ. I'm so worried about my puppy, Pierre. I brought him to the park, and I cannot find him anywhere. He is lost. A lost puppy? Oh, no! Don't worry, Debris. We'll find your puppy, Pierre. And it sounds like we're not the only ones ready to help. Look! It's Officer Anna! Reporting for duty. Yeah. <laughs> I came as quick as I could. Oh, merci. Well, you're just in time, Officer Anna. This lost puppy is our biggest case yet. Hmm. Then we better be on the lookout for clues. Oh, <gasps> that's Park. I know that Park anywhere. That's Pierre. But where could he be? It sounded like it came from over there. Come on, officers. Let's ride! I wonder where Pierre could have gone. The puppy's not here, but look! There's a trail of leaves coming from that leaf pile. You're right, Officer Blaze. He must have gone through that leaf pile and run that way. Follow those leaves! <laughs> Ooh, 
Look! The leaves go right to that mud puddle. That's where Pierre must have gone next, through the mud. See? Muddy tire tracks. Come on! The muddy tracks lead this way. Aha! Uh -huh. A dog park! Pierre the puppy must be one of these dogs. But how are we going to figure out which dog is Pierre? I know. We'll use deduction. Remember, deduction is using facts to get closer and closer to an answer. Let's think. What facts do we know about Pierre? Here's a fact. We know Pierre went through a pile of leaves. So the dog we're looking for is going to have leaves on it. Good thinking, AJ. Let's count how many of these dogs have leaves on them. Okay, dogs, line up. Count the dogs that have leaves. One, two, three, four, five. Great. So Pierre must be one of these five dogs. What other facts do we know? Hmm. We know that after the leaves, Pierre went through a mud puddle. So the dog we're looking for is going to have muddy tires. Let's count how many of these dogs have muddy tires. Count the muddy dogs with me. One, two, three. That means Pierre must be one of these three dogs. I just wish we knew one more fact about Pierre. Wait, I remember something. His bark. Oh, yeah. We heard Pierre make a barking noise that sounded like this. Listen carefully to hear which dog has the same bark. <coughs> which dog sounds like Pierre? That one, yeah! Great work! <coughs> hey there, little puppy. Are you Pierre? <coughs> yeah! He found it! <laughs> we sure are happy to see you, pup. But not as happy as someone else we know. Pierre! Thanks for playing. Oh, Pierre, I was so worried about you. Oh, thank you, officers. If it weren't for you, I would never have found my puppy, Pierre. And I wouldn't have found my grandma. Mm-hmm, that's true. Let's hear it for Officer Blaze and Officer AJ, heroes of Axel City. Super Blaze, look! Hubcaps, those robots are making big trouble. Someone's got to stop them before they destroy Axel City. Trouble. We can do it, AJ. We're superheroes now. Yeah, no problems too big for us. We've got Super Wheels. All right, let's give Blaze a superhero makeover. First things first, a new paint job. Let's try yellow and green. What about blue and purple? Maybe aqua and blue. That looks awesome! Great work! Let's change Blaze's pattern next. Let's try this chocolate pattern. Or maybe this cheese pattern. How about this metal pattern? What a great pattern! Nice job! Trouble, trouble, trouble! Robot just launched a giant bowl of cheese at Clive's Bakery. Cheese Louise! Don't worry, Clive. Help is on the way. To melt cheese, we need to heat it to a temperature of 55 degrees. Which of the numbers is 55? Tap on the correct answer. You're right! 55 degrees! And he just launched a giant bowl of chocolate! To melt chocolate, 
We've got to heat it to a temperature of 90 degrees. Which of the numbers is 90? Tap on the correct answer. That's right! 90, 90 degrees! degrees! Save the toy store! Trouble, trouble, trouble. Now if only there was something we could do about that trouble robot! Hey, I've got an idea! Look! There's a button on the robot! It's a go back to space button! So long, trouble robot! Trouble, trouble, trouble. <laughs> Let's go find those robots and stop them before they make any more trouble. Yeah! Trouble! That trouble robot just took a bite out of the roller coaster. And the ride's headed towards the hole. Woo! All right. Gaskets, we've got to fix that roller coaster and fast. Super wheels! To fix the roller coaster, we need a piece shaped like this. Quick, Blaze, use your strength power to bend that piece of metal. Is this piece of metal the same shape as the hole? Tap on the green check mark button for yes, or the red X button for no. But look over there! Uh-oh! He just ate one last piece of the roller coaster! Yeah! Is this the same shape? Tap on the correct answer. Uh-uh! Hurry, Blaze! Is this the same shape? Tap on the correct answer. Yeah! Ah! Trouble, trouble, trouble. Your troublemaking days are over. Trouble, 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 trouble. trouble. Super Blaze! Oh, you're welcome. Check it out. We just sent another trouble robot back to space. How many robots are left? One. Right. And we've got the superpowers to stop him. Yeah, we've got Super Wheels! Awesome! Let's give Blaze another heroic makeover. We'll start with a new paint job. How about aqua and purple? Or maybe red and green? Let's try green and blue. That looks super! Way to go! Next, let's try a new pattern. Let's try this sprinkles pattern. How about this grass pattern? Maybe this lightning pattern. What an awesome pattern! Nice going! <laughs> it's a trouble robot from outer space! Super Wheels Flying Power! robot throws things super far. Trouble, trouble, trouble. Luck nuts, it just threw that little dog's house. We need to speed up and catch it before that dog house hits the ground. Help me accelerate to a speed of seven. Help Blaze speed up to seven by tapping on the blue button. Count to seven with me. One, 
Two, three, four, five, six, seven! Here you go, little fella! Look! The trouble robot's right over there! He's headed for Crusher and Pickle! Wow, Crusher! Did you make that cake for us? I sure did, Pickle! It's a perfect cake for a perfect day! Trouble. The kind of day Trouble. where Trouble. nothing else Trouble. can go Trouble. wrong! Trouble. Trouble. Except the cake getting tossed away by a giant robot! <laughs> to catch that cake, we've got to accelerate to a speed of 10! Tap on the blue button to help Blaze speed up to 10. Count to 10 with me. One, two, two three, three, four, four five, five, six, six seven, seven, eight, nine, ten. I got it! My cake! <laughs> Yay! Thank you, Super Blaze. Trouble. Trouble. Now let's take care of this last trouble robot once and for all. Trouble, 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 trouble. These robots will never make trouble in Axis City again. Trouble, 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 trouble. 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 Trouble
Super Pickle to the rescue! This looks like a job for Super Pickle and my amazing ice power! Hey, robot! Try these on for size! Ice roller skates! Rick, 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 Rick. Woohoo! Oh, yeah! Way to go, Super Pickle! You just stopped that wrecking robot! But there's still more robots on the loose. Let's count how many robots are left. One, two, three, four. Right. Who can use their bubble power to help us? Super Pickle with ice power? Super Blaze and AJ with super strength? Or Super Crusher with bubble power? Yes, it's time for Super Crusher. Well, you robots are no match for Super Crusher and my bubble power. I'll stop your trouble with a giant bubble. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, rock. Nice work, Super Crusher. You stopped another wrecking robot. But there are still some left. How many robots are there now? Three. And we better stop them fast, because they're headed right for that birthday party. Oh, no. Let's use super strength to try and stop the robots this time. Who can use their super strength to help us? Super Pickle with ice power? Super Blaze and Super AJ with super strength? Or Super Crusher with bubble power? Yeah, here comes Super Blaze and AJ. Wow! Come on, Super AJ. We've got to use our super strength and stop those robots. What do we do with these robots now? Well, here's an observation. Looks like these robots have a special button. A button that can change the robots from wrecking to cleaning. All right. It's working. Yeah, the robots are cleaning up the mess they made. And that's how the Super Team saved the city from wrecking robots and made it the cleanest place in the whole world. <laughs> you did it, Flippy! Your tail's all better! This means Flippy's ready to go back home and be with his family. See? They're waiting for him in the ocean. <laughs> Aw, Flippy's excited to go back to his family. Well, Blaze, how's Flippy going to get all the way to the ocean? I can get Flippy home. I just need to transform into a truck strong enough to pull a huge tank of water. Tap on Blaze to transform him into a big rig. Oh, yeah! I'm a big rig monster machine! All right, let's give Blaze a big rig makeover. We'll start with a new paint job. Let's try green and yellow. What about pink and blue? Maybe blue and green? That looks awesome! Great work! Let's change Blaze's pattern next. Let's try this machine pattern. Or maybe this tire pattern? How about this metal pattern? What a great pattern! Nice job! 
Hop in, Flippy. It's time to get you home. This tunnel is full of snow. And look, the snowy ground. It's breaking apart. <laughs> Phew, that's a big hole in the ground. To get across, we're going to need a ramp so we can jump to the other side. But Blaze, where are we going to find a ramp? Flippy made an ice ramp for us using water. Hang on, everyone. Let's give Flippy's ice ramp a try. <laughs> we made it! Thanks for your help, Flippy. Now come on, let's keep going. Be on the lookout in case the snowy ground starts breaking again. If you see the ground breaking, Tap on it. There, it's breaking. If the ground starts breaking again, tap on it. Yeah, it's breaking. Go for it, Flippy. Oh, oh right. We made it out of the cave. And we couldn't have done it without you, Flippy. Beware of giant fruit? Oh, no! Look out, Blaze! There's a giant orange headed this way! Don't worry. If we speed up, we can smash right through it. Help Blaze speed up to 50 by tapping on the blue button. Count by tens with us. 10, 10 20, 30, 40. 40. Yeah! Way to go, Big Rig Blaze! Thanks, but well, we're not done yet. Uh-oh, looks like there's one more giant fruit coming our way! Tap on the blue button to help Blaze speed up to 100. Count by tens with us. 10, Ten 20, 20, 30, 40, 40 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100! We made it past all the giant fruit! Awesome! Let's give Blaze a monster makeover! First things first, a new paint job. How about yellow and purple? Let's try red and blue. Let's try pink and teal. That looks fabulous! Way to go! Next, let's try a fruit-tastic pattern. How about this apple pattern? Let's try this pineapple pattern. Maybe this orange pattern. 
What a yummy looking pattern! Nice going! Now, let's get Flippy home. Hang on, Flippy. Big Red Blades is gonna get you home. Big Red You're almost home, Flippy. The ocean's just on the other side of these mountains. Whoa! Hang on, Blaze. I don't think mountains are supposed to sound like that. Hubcaps, look up ahead. It's a volcano. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah! Flippy just cooled that lava with water. Come on, Flippy. Let's go cool some hot lava. To help Flippy, let's count how many lava balls there are. Tap on each lava ball to count it. One, two, three. Good work. Hey, Flippy, can you make a splash big enough to cool three lava balls? <laughs> One. Yeah! We've almost made it past the volcano. How many lava balls are there now? Tap on each one to count it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nice job. Go for it, Flippy. We need your biggest flip ever. Flippy, we're gonna get you home super fast. Time for Big Rig Blazing Speed. <laughs> to give me blazing speed, say, let's blaze. To give him blazing speed, tap the let's blaze button. Again. I've got to stop those robots before they wreck the whole city. Whoa, those robots are more powerful than I thought. Hey, what if we build a robot of our own? Come on, everyone. It's time to use robotics. Whoa! Let's press the button to transform Blaze into a robot. I'm Robot Blaze! Awesome! Let's give Robot Blaze a monster makeover. We'll start with a new paint job. Should we paint him purple and green? Let's try pink and yellow. How about blue and orange? That looks awesome! Nice job! Let's put a pattern on Blaze next. How does this one look? Or maybe this one? Let's try this one. That's a cool pattern! Nice job! Click on the window to help Blaze fix it. Great! 
great job! Yeah! All right. Come on, AJ. Time to save Axel City from those wrecking robots. Let's go for it! Robot power! Yahoo! <laughs> <laughs> Quick! Click on the end of the rope to help Blaze catch it! Gotcha! Whew. Thanks, Robot Blaze! All right, that was some quick thinking. Blaze, look! Gaskets, he's chopping like crazy! How are we gonna stop him? There's only one way to stop a powerful chomping robot. Feed it something it can't chomp. Hey, that piece of wood looks pretty tough. Check out this piece of metal. What about that piece of concrete? Which piece is strong enough to help Blaze stop the chomping robot? Is it the wooden piece? The metal piece? How about the concrete piece? You're right! The metal piece is the strongest! Yeah! Alright! Way to go, Robot Blaze! Robot Power! Blaze, watch out! Look, it's the throwing robot! He's in the park! I can help you, Blaze, with coding! Coding is when you give instructions to a robot. This instruction will tell Robot Blaze to go. This instruction will tell him to smash with his powerful robot arms. And this instruction will tell him to stop. Click on the code to run it. Go! Smash! Stop! Uh-oh! That throwing robot is throwing two things this time. Help me code Blaze's arms to do two smashes. Which piece of code will tell Blaze to do two smashes? That's right! That's a group of two. So our new code is... Go, smash, smash, stop! Click on the code to run it! Go! Smash! Smash! Stop! Woohoo! Yeah! Look, the throwing robot is just up ahead! Lug nuts! He just threw four things! Which piece of code will tell Blaze to do four smashes? Oh, yeah! Great job! All right! So now our code is go, smash, 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 stop! Click on the code to run it. Go! Smash! 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 And stop! <laughs> the throwing robot! Let's give Blaze a makeover to get him ready for the next robot. We'll start with a new paint job. Let's try orange and purple. How about blue and green? Or maybe pink and aqua? That looks amazing! Let's give him a new pattern too. Does this look good? How about this one? Or this one? Way to go! Ah! 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 Let's get out of here! Hubcaps, there he is! The blasting robot! Whoa! His blast is really powerful! Hey, I've got an idea! Let's try giving our robot Blazing speed! Yeah! Get ready to hit the Let's Blaze button! Let's Blaze! <laughs> Look! My force went up to 10! And the robot's blast is nine. 
Which number is the bigger number? 10 or nine? 10, that means I've got more force. Great job. <laughs> <laughs> Every toothbrush in Axel City is being taken away. Look, the toothbrushes are going into that giant rocket ship. Time to become Special Mission Blaze. We're on a mission to retrieve the missing toothbrushes in Axel City that were taken by the toothbrush taker. Awesome. Check it out. These buttons give Special Mission Blaze cool new upgrades. Let's press the green button to try submarine mode. With submarine power, I can travel underwater. Now let's press the purple button to try force shield mode. With a force shield, I can block anything that gets in our way. Last, press the orange button to try laser mode. The laser can give us the power to cut through anything. Wow. Now nothing can stop us from getting those toothbrushes. the Toothbrush Taker's Island. To get to the Toothbrush Taker's Island across the ocean, which mission mode button should we press? The submarine button, the shield button, or the laser button? The submarine button, right! Hey, I've got an idea. Maybe we can find something to float them away. Yeah! We just need to find things that don't have a lot of density. Density is all about the particles inside of things. When something has lots of heavy particles inside, it has more density. But when something has fewer, lighter particles, it has less density. Things that have more density tend to sink. And things that are less dense tend to float. Here, maybe one of these can float the chomper fish away. We've got beach balls and bowling balls. Beach balls have a density of two, and bowling balls have a density of eight. Which number is less, two or eight? Two, right! That means beach balls have less density. Load the beach balls! Let's press this button to launch the beach balls. Beach balls away! Hooray! It worked! The chopper fish is floating away! Come on! These chopper fish can't stop us! Because we know about density! We did it! We got past the chomper fish and made it to the toothbrush shaker's island! And look! There's his secret hideout! Come on, everybody! Let's go get our toothbrushes back! Special, Special mission! mission There it is! The rocket ship with all our toothbrushes inside! Oh, finally! My toothbrush! I'm coming, toothbrush! Usher, wait! There still could be one last... Trap! Gasket! 
It's a giant trap! <laughs> <gasps> and look! It's Tooth City 2! <laughs> the toothbrush taker! Well, well, special mission blaze. <laughs> I should have known you'd try to stop me. You won't get away with this toothbrush taker. Oh, but I already have. Rocket ship preparing for blast off. Oh, <laughs> it's finally working. Oh no, we'll never get our toothbrushes back in time. Oh yes, we will, because that toothbrush taker forgot about one thing. We've still got our special mission modes. To cut through the metal, which button should we press? The submarine button, the shield button, or the laser button? The laser button, right! Chip blasting off. The rocket's taking off with all the toothbrushes! <laughs> the only way to stop it is to press that off button. And fast! Then it's time to use special mission blazing speed! <laughs> to give me blazing speed, say, let's blaze! Rocket ship turning off. <laughs> But toothbrush taker, I don't understand. Why'd you want to get rid of everyone's toothbrushes? Yeah, don't you like brushing your teeth? Actually, the truth is I, I, I don't know how to brush my teeth. <laughs> hey, that's okay. We can teach you how to brush your teeth. Really? Yeah. All you have to do is take your toothbrush, add some toothpaste, and start brushing. Huh? Oh. <laughs> oh, my teeth feel so sparkly and clean. <laughs> Rocket ship, return the toothbrushes. Rocket ship, returning toothbrushes. I'm gonna need some help getting out of these vines. Do not worry, I help. Whoa, who said that? It's me, Megabot. Should Megabot cut the vines with laser power or banana power? Laser power, of course. Cut vines with laser power. Whoa. Friends need soft landing! To give Blaze a soft landing, should Megabot use rock power or bubble power? Yes, bubble power! Megabot use bubble power! <laughs> Blaze is covered in mud! Should Megabot clean him up with water power? or Nacho's power. Definitely water power. Great work! 
Megabot make clean with water power! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Megabot. You really helped us. My name's AJ, and that's Blaze. Hello! It's nice to meet you, Blaze and AJ! Wow! You can do so many cool things, Megabot! I bet you'd be a big hit at the Robot Parade! Robot Parade? What is Robot Parade? It's a big celebration! Just for robots like you! Ooh! Robot Parade look fun! Hey, I've got an idea, Megabot! Why don't you come with us? Yeah! We can take you to the Robot Parade! Oh, yeah! Megabot wants! Megabot wants to go to Robot Parade! <laughs> All right! Follow us, Megabot! To the Robot Parade! Yeah. Woohoo! Must be a glue geyser. Oh no! Megabot cannot go to parade if stuck in glue. Don't worry, Megabot. I've got an idea how we can get past that glue geyser. Yeah, we just need to know its diameter. Diameter is the distance across the middle of a circle. And glue geysers are shaped like circles. If we measure their diameter, we can block the geysers so they can't blast any more glue. Come on, let's measure the diameter of that first glue geyser. The hole has a diameter of this number. What number is this? Six, yeah! Now we just need a circle with that same diameter. Woo, Megabot, help! <laughs> Diameter six! Whoa! Megabot's cutting a circle with her laser power! I'll take it from here, Megabot! Megabot? Whoa, hang on. That looks like smoke. Gaskets. There are fires up in those trees. Whoa, Megabot, help. Use water power. Oh, but water not go high enough to put out flames. Don't worry, Megabot. Blaze and I can help lift you up higher. Yeah. We just need a turntable ladder truck. To make a turntable ladder truck, first, drag over the tall ladder. Ladder! Nice! Now, drag over the hydraulic piston rod. It makes the ladder move up and down. Piston rod! Great work! Last, drag over the turntable. The turntable lets us spin the ladder in any direction. Turntable! Oh yeah! I'm a turntable ladder truck monster machine! Ooh, wonderful! Hop in, Megabot. Let's put out those fires. Good 
make a bot? There's Axel City! We're getting close to the robot parade! Megabot's so excited! <laughs> Come on, Megabot, this way! Baskets, Crusher, Pickle, and all those robots are stuck on top of those giant pancakes. We've got to help them. But how will we get all the way to the top of that giant stack of pancakes? Ooh, Megabot, no. Make friends go high in air with bubble power. We'll help you. Let's count to make a bubble with a diameter of 10. Count to 10 with us. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Megabot, it's time to use blazing speed. <laughs> to give us blazing speed, say, let's blaze. Let's blaze. <laughs> We did it, Megabot! Blaze, AJ, and Megabot make great team! Ooh, listen, everyone! It's time for the robot parade to start! Ooh. Parade! Yeah, but... We still don't know which robot's gonna lead the parade. I think Megabot should lead parade. Megabot, 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 Megabot. Do you hear that, Megabot? All the robots want you to lead the parade. Wow! But Megabot cannot lead parade alone. Why not, Megabot? Because Megabot want to lead parade with Blaze and AJ! Yeah! Let's do it, Megabot! Let Robot Parade begin! Robot Parade! Race, Sparkle needs three more badges. Let's help her get them. Hey, check it out! Train tracks! If we want to go fast, we need to transform. Ooh, I know! We can be high-speed trains! Yeah! First, we need steel wheels. They let high-speed trains ride on metal tracks. Great! Steel wheels! Now, let's add the locomotion engines. They give trains power to go really fast. Awesome! Locomotive engines! Last, let's add aerodynamic bodies. They make it so air doesn't slow the train down. Aerodynamic bodies! 
Train-tastic! Oh, yeah! For high-speed train... To the tracks. Help us keep away from them. Which track has trash on it? The blue track. Yeah. Quick, Sparkle, switch tracks. <laughs> <laughs> Great job. Sparkle needs two more stickers to compete in the yeah. race. Well, what are we waiting for? This uh, way to the monster dome. to get back to the big race and... Uh-oh, that's a lot of water. I wonder how we're gonna get across. I can't wait to get back to the big race and... Uh-oh, that's a lot of water. I wonder how we're gonna get across. Oh, I have an idea. Why don't we ask them for help? No! Check it out. The red whale will launch Blaze with this trajectory. The green whale will launch Blaze with this trajectory. And the yellow whale will launch Blaze with this trajectory. Which one will get Blaze and Sparkle to that island? The red whale, yeah! at the other side. Whoa! Hiya, whales. We need your help one last time. Ooh. Here are the trajectories. Which one will get them all the way to the shore? The green whale. Yeah! Sparkle. You just need one more. Then you can be in the big race. Hey, look. There's the monster dome. <laughs> We're almost there. Come on, Sparkle. Let's hurry and get to that race. Yeah! Blaze and Sparkle are almost back. <laughs> yeah. Blaze and Sparkle are almost back! Ew, my customers! Oh, I've got to stop them! I need a cheat so big they'll never make it back! A builder bot! Bot's making a wall to try to stop us. I've got an idea. What if we go over the wall with this? A slingshot. Yeah, that's a great idea, Sparkle. We just need to launch ourselves with the right trajectory. Let's see. If we launch ourselves now, we will go through the air like this. Will that get us over the wall? No. Let's change our trajectory. Will this trajectory get us over the wall? Yeah! We've got the right trajectory! Yeah! We did it! Ooh, and look! There's the monster dome! Uh-oh, but the Builder Pod is trying to stop us with the biggest wall yet! Come on, Sparkle! It's slingshot time! Will this trajectory get us over the wall? Nope. Let's try again. Will this trajectory get us over the wall? Yes! Monster Dome, here we come! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no. It can't be. 
luck, everybody! Sticker. Hang on, Sparkle. Look! You're getting your last sticker! Ooh, wow! <gasps> I did it! I got all my stickers! That means I can race! Yeah. Come on, y'all! Yeah. Racers on your marks! Get set! line now, except for me! <laughs> oh man, we've got to find some way to get across! Ooh, I know! What if we go super fast and jump across? Yeah! Time to use blazing speed! <laughs> Give us blazing speed. Say, let's blaze! Let's blaze! to subscribe to Nick Jr.'s Blaze and the Monster Machines YouTube channel for new videos every week. <laughs>